Oh, what is happening, people? We welcome you to Organo Alpha. It is time for evolution. I haven't done one of these in a while, but yeah, it is time for evolution. And it's also my birthday, December 23rd. Uh, I'm, this video is going to be uploaded on Friday or Saturday. So, December 23rd was when I, you know, did the, this voice recording here. So, so yeah, uh, to, in today's video. We're going to be speaking about focus and distractions. And also, one thing I also wanted to mention, it was, you know, it's December 21st. This is the big deal that everyone was was making, you know, uh, with uh, the Jupiter and, and Saturn conjunction that was taking place there. That, that takes place, you know, years like it. Like, it's, it's a very rare, rare occasion to see Jupiter and Saturn in the sky like that, you know. And it, and... It, it, it was a pretty big deal and it also symbolizes like the, the age like a, a transitioning age like we were moving before we were more earth based but now like with Aquarius which is like you know the the air and en energy is more so like uh, innovations new innovations to come you know so, so something like that if you're into into like astrology but you know it, it was a pretty big deal it was a pretty big deal even on Twitter uh, there was there was memes of like black people receiving like superpowers at December December twenty first, which is pretty cool, you know. But yeah, it, it, it was it was a pretty rare and amazing amazing event that took place, you know. And I did uh, I did spend time with a few people. Uh, I didn't get to see it because of you know the clouds. I couldn't uh, yeah I couldn't see it because like the clouds are blocking the. Uh, this uh you know the, the the two planets but uh but yeah it, it was a pretty cool thing but uh yes today today we're going to be speaking about uh focus and distractions you know and and also and also when it comes to like so when it comes to like distractions like this has been a 2020 has been a really huge here a uh, really huge you know year of people you know essentially getting distracted you know there's been a lot of uh you know fear-based you know media on the news uh even on even on twitter like there's there's, there's there's always something there's always something uh something to worry about that's that that's constantly being pushed on on social medias on on the television channels you know there's constant uh there's a consistency of that and at the same time like I feel like it takes uh you know so let's take some personal like responsibility for our for our mental state for our emotional state to like you know kind of get out of that area and more into something that we wish to focus and hone in on to that focus and hone in on like our, our passions or our goals uh compared to you know having having this 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 uh, constant state of fear and it's also good to understand what's going on in, in the world, but at the same time, we don't want this to like consume every every single thing that we that we do. the The main purpose that we want to to achieve is you know our our purpose, our passions, our goals, and so that's where the our energies should uh, should be more uh, focused on. So I, I did speak about that that attention is a is 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 a is the biggest currency. So attention is more more valuable than money because with with attention you can gain a skill. Everything starts with your attention, what you give attention to. You know, when you give attention when 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 all areas of your life gives attention to one thing, most most likely you'll be able to to attract that thing into your life much more faster. You know, because all of your attention, your mind, your body your soul, everything is going into that one direction, and there's nothing, there's no like external things that are trying to pull you into into a uh, a, a distracting direction, you know, that's not in align with your with your purpose or goals. So I, I even have I even have experience with this, you know, even even now, like there's I, I've been getting like a lot of people like uh, just message messaging me on on certain things they would they want to they want to like uh you know hang out and and do you know it, it, they, they it just feels like this this is like the time since since no one is really doing much yeah since no one is really like doing much since with 
with all the with the the lockdowns or like just people there's just a lot of places are closed so now people are starting to connect with one another which is good but at the same time like this is also a time to hone in and and uh, like focus on a skill or a passion or a purpose you know now that most things are are, are closed like there's no parties going on there's uh the, yeah there's really there's really no no huge huge uh, huge events that's happening now is like the time to to really focus and hone in on that you know it's, it's like it's like for example like uh and in the past we, we had all these geniuses like like leonardo da vinci you know and i'm pretty sure like if, if social media existed in his time and, and, and if he was he was raised if leonardo was raised on social media he'd get a lot of distractions and he wouldn't get all the the genius you know the the genius inventions that he that he has created in his uh in his solitude you know in his uh and his focus and his you know where his he he placed high attention onto onto his craft onto his purpose which is why like in the past there's been so much so many geniuses in my opinion you know and there there still are geniuses today you know it's just that some of us are more distracted than you know than than others so i think at, at this point it just it just comes to like what where do you want to place your focus on you know there's a lot of people that want to like steal your attention. Sometimes I want to distract you from what you're from what you're doing. I want to sometimes hang out. You know, I, I, I do sometimes like to hang out, but not not all the time. I most of the times I want to, you know, just get things done or like learn or like build build a skill. You know, I'm usually uh, I'm usually pretty busy, and at the same time, and at the same time, I think this is like a time for other people to. You know, just you know, get busy within themselves. Like, learn how to meditate. Learn, learn a new skill. You know, learn how to skateboard or something. Um, learn, you know, just just learn, learn how to draw. You know, learn, learn something, learn something, and and hone in, hone in on that. You know, because there can be a lot of there can be a lot of uh, distractions. You know, like even even when it comes to video games, that can be uh, highly uh, distracting when you're like. Uh, just honing just just playing the video game but it, i think i think that uh in in moderation is good in moderation but like when you're playing it for like 24 7 and you're not doing like you don't have any like just 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 goals that you wish to accomplish then it can be an issue in the game when you're spending more time with the game as opposed to your purpose but at the same time you can have a i guess a, a gaming youtube channel and you can start doing start uploading gaming gaming content on there with commentary and whatnot and and video editing and and, and all that stuff but it, again it, it just depends on people's uh it, de it just depends on people's purpose so so what what do you want out of life essentially you know what do you want to do what do you want to uh what do you want to become you know in the future like when when i when i'm so now what I'm starting to think is that, you know, how will something like if something is presented to me, like I, I tend to think that, you know, how will will this will in, in like in like in five years, like in five years, the thing that I'm going through now or the thing that's uh, that I'm uh, interacting or interfacing with, will it matter in five years or so? And if it wouldn't matter in five years, then it's pointless, you know. So that's usually how i uh how i'm starting to to view uh certain things when well yeah when certain things are, are presented to me and so the main theme i have for 2021 as we're going into 2021 is to stay focused and, and harness your attention as to what you want to create out of your life you know 2021 is going to be a year of extremes and a year like you know a year of positive extremes and a year of negative extremes you know I, I believe there will be some positive innovations that will be uh, made in this year. You know, at the same time, there will be some things that will be exposed. There will be some, you know, negative, you know, some negative events that may take place. But again, don't let it, don't let it distract you. Don't let it, uh, you know, don't let it sway your path. Don't let it sway your, 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 your objective. You know, stay focused, as they say. 
and I'm I'm definitely expecting some 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 alien disclosure happening, you know, in 2021 maybe. You know, if not 2021, then maybe 2021 to to 2025, around those time frames, we're going to get something. Because it kind of seems like 2020. And so as we move on to 2021, I'm expecting some uh, massive positive changes and some massive negative changes. You know, some some negative events, at least. There's going to be positive events and, and negative events that will be taking place. It's going to be, like, amplified. If you thought 2020 or something, just wait till 2020, 21. You know, 2020, 2021 is like 2020 Part 2. It's like the sequel, you know, the, the next movie. You know, grab your popcorn, folks. But, yeah, that will be the video, guys. Thank you guys for watching. And, uh, yeah, peace.